And welcome to Winter Garden Sacred Space Meditation Service. It is good to be here with you this day. The service is about listening and silence and scripture and the sacrament. So for those of you at home, please grab bread and juice to join us for the Lord's Supper. And those of you who are here, we have bread and juice to dip because I haven't gotten our communion cups. So, so we hope you are able to open your heart to God in this time and see how God might be speaking to you. Our scripture lesson is from Psalm 107, verses 1 through 9 and verse 43. Listen now to these words from the psalmist. Give thanks for Yahweh's goodness. God's love endures forever. Let these be the words of Yahweh's redeemed, those redeemed from the oppressor's clutches, those brought home from foreign lands, from east and west, from northern lands and southern seas. Some lost their way in the wilderness and the wasteland, not knowing how to reach an, inha an inhabited town. They were hungry and thirsty and their courage was running low. They called to Yahweh in their trouble, and God rescued them from their sufferings, guiding them by a direct route to an inhabited town. Let them thank Yahweh for this great love, for the marvels done for all people. For God has satisfied the thirsty and filled the hungry with good things. If you are wise, study these things and realize the great love of Yahweh. Friends, let us go into a time of silent meditation on God's word this day.
I love that version of Nearer My God to Thee from the piano guys. So thank you for enduring that. As we prepare our hearts for the Lord's Supper, hear these words from the Apostle Paul. What I have passed on to you I received from Christ, that on the night he was betrayed, our Savior Jesus took bread, gave thanks and broke it, saying, this is my body which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way, after supper, he took the cup and said, this cup is the new covenant in my blood. Whenever you drink it, do it in remembrance of me. For every time you eat this bread and drink this cup, you proclaim Jesus' death until Christ comes again. So friends, this is the body of Christ that is broken for you. Up of the new covenant. So come and taste and see that the Lord is good. Out of Christ. Let us pray. God, we pray that everything we do can draw us nearer to you and how you call us to live and be your people. Allow us to find ways to share these simple gifts with those we meet, knowing that people are on all different types of journeys that maybe we have the opportunity to help their journey along for whatever time that might be. To God, through these gifts of bread and cup this day, remind us of how simple it is to love one another. In your name I pray. Amen.
from Psalm 107, verse 8 and 9 said, Let them thank Yahweh for, for this great love, for the marvels done for all people. For God has satisfied the thirsty and filled the hungry with good things. So friends, I pray this week that you are filled with good things and that you are able to share those good things with others. So go in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, the creator, redeemer, and sustainer of us all, and be at peace. Amen. <laughs>